My name is Emery Warner and I'm from the Marine Gateway Club. In 2013, things were different. I just wasn't happy. When you are starting to drink a lot and your body can't really keep up, it's midnight, you're, you're, you've had 12 plus drinks, you're tired, all of a sudden, people start sharing some other stuff with you. And all of a sudden, you're back, you're, it's party mode again, and it's midnight, and you can keep going for another four or five hours if you wanted to. I was smoking almost two packs a day. I'm looking at the future with just an overall sense of hopelessness. And I started to self-medicate. I was about to go out, and I'm, I'm, I'm lacing up my boots, and I'm bending over, and it was such a struggle. I'm like holding my breath, gagging, and uh, it was that moment that I realized, you know, something's got to budge if I can't do these basic things. And when I saw that 330 pounds on that scale, uh, I saw it almost as an impossible task. I decided that I needed to take back control of my life because I let it go away because I didn't value it anymore. This is my girlfriend, Zoe. She's been a major inspiration for me. During birth, the doctor, this arm was like out, and it's, it's not exactly clear how, but they tugged on this arm to, to pull me out, and when they did that, they caused nerve damage. For a long time, I just wouldn't talk about it. And I'd have to say that during my fitness journey, getting myself more healthier, um, gaining the confidence that I never really had and uh, I've been more open to talk about it, and I've been using it for more things. Nowadays I, I go to the gym, I exercise four to sometimes seven days a week. So what keeps me motivated to keep going is um, I look back at the lifestyle that I was living and how unhappy I was. I remember when I stepped on the scale and I hit 230 pounds and I actually hit 100 pounds less. I remember going and to the gym and picking up the 100 pound dumbbell or the, the weight and thinking this is how much stuff I used to walk around with every day and thinking that I legitimately thought it was impossible. I lost the weight about a year ago and lately it's just been focusing on uh, athletic ability. And I remember just thinking, I actually like, did it. <laughs> when I'm having um, stressful days, I know that the best medicine, no matter what, is to go and be active. Don't ever give up because there might be times where you might have to give yourself a break. There might be times where you have to stop, but don't ever give up.